Hey, actor man! Could I be in the dub? Of course you can be in the dub! As long as you have a good microphone and can act convincingly and go through the audition process and then you are the best match for the part. What I'm trying to say is I love to involve everyone I can to dub, but I can't simply, you know, hand out roles just on a whim. I hold auditions semi-regularly at uh, this place called the Voice Acting Alliance, and from now on, I will post alerts on the website and on YouTube, and if you're interested, you just click on the link, you go on over, and you do what I tell you. I must stress, though, that if you cannot act, and you do not have at least decent mic quality, then I can't put you in the dub. I love to get everyone involved that I can, and it's not unheard of that a fan or a subscriber goes over and auditions and gets in. It's happened before. But I have to be real with you, because I am the director. Boom. No, oh, actor man. I was wondering if I could maybe play. Insert character name here. Well, I answered part of that before, but since this is a more specific question, I should tell you that the part you want to play is probably already cast. Um, except for Aiko, who recently went back up for uh, audition. That hasn't happened yet, so don't freak out. Um, I had an initial casting call where I cast a bunch of the characters that cast later slash haven't appeared yet, like Amarant and Garland, even. There are a bunch of parts still like Mr. 288 or Mikoto, uh, and as you know, recasts aren't unheard of, so don't lose hope completely, but don't get your hopes up either. Uh, keep your hopes kinda in hope limbo until I say something. Alright? Hey, actor man. How's about you dub Final Fantasy? Insert number here. Ah, oh, come on, that one's my favorite! No. Nope. No way. Absolutely not. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, Final Fantasy IX is my favorite game in the series, and that's why I devote so much attention to it. Dubbing is a chore. Dubbing an entire game is an extremely huge ordeal that I would be insane to try to undertake again. It's one of the most stressful and time-consuming and long-running projects I've ever undergone in my life. And it's really not uh, glamorous. <laughs> I don't love any other game the way I do Final Fantasy IX. I can't see myself going through all this trouble again for a game that doesn't resonate as much with me. The most I would ever do is clips from other games, but even then I wouldn't exactly call it likely, you know? Hey, actor man! Why do you mispronounce characters' names? Alright, you can't look me in the face with good conscience and say that Zidam sounds better than Zidane. It's how it's spelled. I don't care that the translators messed up. I think they made it sound better. Um, I know in Japan they call him Jitan, but we're not in Japan. Uh, this, I, I just, I don't know. That's how I said... Zidane when I first played the game when I was 10 and I'm too stubborn and pig-headed to let you guys tell me that I'm wrong. <laughs> it's like learning 10 years later that Eris's name is actually Aerith. Hey, actor man. What's your favorite kind of cheese? I don't call myself a cheese connoisseur by any means, but I've had a fair number of cheeses in my day, among my favorites being Jarlsberg cheese, a semi-hard Swiss cheese imported from Norway. It's noted for its versatility as well as its subtle, nutty flavor. Use it on anything or eat it by itself, it's all good. I also make a cheese ball dessert that's to die for, but that uses cream cheese, so I guess that's kind of cheating. Hey, actor man! Could I add you on Skype? There's a lot of really cool things I want to talk to you about! I'm kind of wary of this, actually. Not because I don't want to talk to any of you, but mostly just because I don't have time. I've had a couple people hunt me up on Skype only for me to tell them just over and over that I'm too busy to talk. I'm not internet famous or anything. I don't, like, it's not that too many people are adding me, nor will it ever be. I just won't give out my screen name, but if you want to hunt me up and are somehow lucky enough to find me at a time when I have that funny little thing called free time, and yeah, we can talk about Final Fantasy or whatever. Hey, actor man. Are you as attractive in person as you sound? Why, yes. I am. Dear actor!
Doctor Man, what is your favorite song from Final Fantasy IX? Whew, tough one, but I gotta go with my gut, and that is You're Not Alone. Just, I feel like that's one of the best, most iconic songs from Final Fantasy IX and from just video gaming as a whole. It's really just amazing. Howdy, actor man. Can you advertise my dub? Alright, I've had this one a lot recently. It's not terribly hard to make me enjoy a dub. It is hard to make me enjoy a fan dub so much that I feel that it is so exceptional that I would tell 1,000 people to drop what they're doing and go watch it. That takes a commitment to quality and a very well-rounded cast. I mean, send me what you're working on and maybe I can give you some feedback or something. I, I don't pretend that I'm the best dubber on YouTube, but I've been working on this project and others long enough, uh, both behind the scenes and in front of the mic, that I can hopefully offer some educated and helpful experience. Uh, the short answer is, unless there's an extraordinary case, no, I will not advertise you. Oh, actor man, will you marry me? Okay. <laughs>